Hey guys, what's up? It's Destiny here, and we are going to be doing a makeup look today. You're going to start with the number two look, or the number two eyeshadow, which is this one in the middle for me. And you're going to put that all over the lid of your eye. As you can see, I'm doing quick. Next, you're going to take your number three, which is the darker color, and you're going to kind of make a C shape in a way, but wing it out just a little bit more. This is also the same color that we're going to be using in our crease, you will see in a second. Um, the second way, as you can see on the second eye, it's just a tad bit easier. And this is a really cool look to do the tape look with. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go ahead and go to my blog and you can find it. I'm just cleaning up some eyeshadow quick so I can uh, make it more precise. And the last color I'm using is that uh, lighter one, and that is my highlight, which I am putting um, in between my eyeshadow and my, or under my brow bone. Um, then you're going to take your brush, you're going to clean off, and you're going to blend all this together. Um, I did a fairly good job blending, could have done better. Uh, and then I took my Pond's Cold Clean Click, uh, this stuff is a miracle, and I put it on to clean up my edges. I normally would just say use a makeup wipe, but I just decided not to during this one. Uh, you just wipe it off quick. I did wipe off some of my foundation, but I didn't really care because my skin is pretty clear there, and it's not red. Next, I took my Blackheart Beauty, the uh, eyebrow, or not eyebrow, um, black eyeliner pencil, and I used that to outline my eyes. Also, just so you know, the eyeshadow I was using was Maybelline New York's uh, new rock nudes palette and also right here what I was doing with the hand was just showing you guys pull down slightly on your eye to do your waterline. Um, right here I winged it out and then blended it quick just because I do not like the defined wings but I do like blending the black out. This is my Star Wars CoverGirl uh, the super lash one as you can see it's a really nice one it's fairly new and I use it and it makes my eyelashes pop a lot, so that's one of the reasons I like using it so much. As you can see, I, I'm also doing the uh, little lashes at the bottom just to define them a little more. This is another Blackheart Beauty product that I use, and it's their red lip stick, one of them. Uh, this is one of my more favorite ones because it's really nice and it's not as dark as the other one I have. Um, here I'm taking down my hair, and you'll see in a minute, poof. It's done. So I didn't. It looks like I'm talking here. Really, just ignore me and look at my hair. Um, I'm not good at poofs. Is basically what I was explaining. Uh, so yeah, this is the finished look, and I hope you guys really like this. I really hope you're ignoring my lips moving. But I was just, basically I used hairspray and a comb and brushed out the bottom, and on the top I basically just took my hair. Well, like twisted it and then pushed it forward a little bit, which I'll show you guys. Here's the up close look at my eyes. Very pretty. And yes, I still have lipstick on the back. I didn't clean that off. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you would like more, go ahead and leave me a comment. Also, if you are uh, just wondering any makeup looks, I have it online. Also, I just really quick decided to do my blush. I'd done contouring stuff beforehand. So here you guys go. Bye! Maybe not? Oh. No, I'm so sorry. Good blush. <laughs> I love making makeup looks for you guys. Please subscribe and like this video. Bye!